So as of lately, I've been dabbing in the modded side of Borderlands. In terms of reviewing certain weapons which fit the narrative of modded items, I will showcase and have no problem with. If you are aware of my stance on modded items, you will know that I'm really against playing with modded items which just completely take away from the fun of the game, i.e. modded items that you can one-shot the hardest of hardest bosses with. But in saying this, since my dabble with modded items, as you can imagine, I've been shown and sent some of the craziest things you can imagine. Today I showcase 5 of these crazy insane modded items. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and today I'll bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like it really helps out and subscribe if you do want to see more. So these modded items in which we'll be showcased today, some are just utterly broke, others are nutty and while some, like I have said, make the game a walk in the park. Now if you have any crazy modded items, anything bizarre or anything you think the world would want to see, hit me up via my discord linked within that video description. Ok so let's get into this top 5. And in at number 5 we have this redistributor. And while this is a level 1 redistributor, but it's possibly the most powerful weapon I think I have ever ever seen. This was originally sent to me ages back in which I refused to use it. But I do think it fits a video like this perfectly. So this redistributor is literally capable of one hitting everything in this game. It is that broken. To a point of this thing not actually dealing damage to that test dummy. It's just blank damage numbers. Now how this thing's been modded I have no idea. Who modded it I have no idea. All I know is this is a prime example of a weapon in which takes away from this game. Yeah for sure some people may enjoy this kind of thing. But to me, the whole experience is taken away when items like this are used. And it's why in reality, it's the only one on this list which is beyond broke in every single way. Here I take a look at what this thing does to everything in this game. Ok so in at number 4 we have King Bobo's Hammer. Now this is a weapon I've already covered in a video here on YouTube, but I thought it would fit this list perfectly as it's the kind of modded item I love to see and play around with. Now this item belongs to King Bobo who you do come across within a side mission upon Ambermere on Eden 6. King Bobo uses this item when he's fighting that dinosaur, can't remember his name. I mean you don't really see it that often within the encounter but it's definitely there. Now this item was extracted from the game files as it obviously doesn't drop anywhere in the game. And it's been edited to fire a laser beam which then spawns in projectiles in which target nearby enemies. Now this item is pretty weak for sure and doesn't really do much damage at all to enemies unless you play on those low mayhem levels. But it's still a cool creation one I really enjoyed seeing and using. Don't say I didn't warn you! Better leave before you get hurt!
Okay, so next up we have something I'm calling the Infinite Unicorn Grenade. This item was made by the Uni Llama, otherwise known as the Mad Scientist when it comes to custom modded items within the Borderlands community. And well, I think you will understand what I mean when you see this thing in action. I mean, this is what I call a mixture of both ugly and beautiful at the same time. I mean, where do you even put your eyes? I'm seeing absolutely everything right here. It's utterly crazy. Unicorns, gas cool ghosts, epicenters. I mean, there's a lot of stuff going down right here, people. Its actual name is the gas cool whispering ice quasar. So yeah. Also, did I mention this thing is infinite? Yes, it never actually ends. It just goes on and on and on. It's absolutely hilarious. Now this item and what it does is kind of crazy. Isn't the most OP thing you will ever see, but too many of these grenades in your screen at once won't end well for you or the enemy. Check it out. So in at number 2 we have an item which appeared in my mail and I can't remember for the life of me who sent it but hey if you are the creator of any item within this video and believe you deserve a mention hit me up on my discord and I will credit you within the video description. So this weapon I'm calling the magic hands of death because that's exactly what it is. I mean you ain't actually holding any weapon but you're firing from your hands and what you are firing is literal death. And well as cool as this thing does indeed look it is also kind of broken. This thing is stupid powerful. Now although I won't put it on the same level as the redistributor we first covered today, it is still utterly broke and it's capable of crazy crazy things. Here, check it out a little more. Ok 
Okay, so in at number one, we have a weapon called the Hyperfocus Web Slinger. And well, this is probably the most fun weapon I've used so far. I mean, yeah, this is a rare weapon, but that doesn't mean absolutely anything here. This one wasn't created to combat enemies. This one was created to make you fly. And that's exactly what this does. Now, if you guys remember the Web Slinger when it first arrived with the Guardian takedown, it gave you the ability to jump extended heights in those low gravity areas, like within the Guardian takedown. Well, this is that same weapon times a billion. And I ain't joking, guys. This thing actually allows you to jump to any height you like, even fly. Now, I don't know how this thing's been done. All I know is I absolutely love it. Slightly press that trigger for a high jump, hold that trigger, and you are traveling to space. It's as simple as that. Here, people, check this amazing little item out a little more. I took it up for this! We make a great pair, which is to say, yeah, I'm great, you look great holding me, but it's... And there we have it guys, five insane modded items, a part of the Borderlands 3 universe. If you guys have anything crazy you want the world to see, hit me up on my Discord linked within that video description. Also guys, if you are new around here and want to support me and the channel, you can become a member with special perks of getting all items I cover within my videos weeks earlier than anyone else. You also get a special role on my Discord. You become a part of a YouTube member chat. And like I said, I will send all you guys who are members of my channel all that loot early. And on that note, guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video, upload, I can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one. <laughs>